Flying a drone in 2025 isn't just about getting cool footage anymore. It's about camera quality, safety features, flight time, and staying on the right side of FAA rules. Whether you're shooting cinematic B-roll or just posting to your Instagram story, the right drone can make your content pop. I've flown and tested the top models this year. And trust me, not all drones are built equal. Here are the five that actually deliver. Let's get into it. Kicking off the list is one of the smartest beginner-friendly drones you can buy right now, the DJI Flip. This thing folds up nice and compact, weighs just 249 grams, and still shoots buttery smooth 4K at 60 frames per second with full HDR and 10-bit color. It's got a solid three-axis gimbal for stabilization, forward obstacle sensors, and about 31 minutes of flight time. That lightweight frame means you can skip FAA registration if you're flying for fun. Is it for pros? Not quite. There's no remote ID and internal storage is tiny, under two gigabytes. But for creators just starting out, it's a total win. And yeah, the price is right too. This one's under 450. Potensic isn't a name you hear every day, but the Atom 2 really surprised me. It's one of the few sub 250 gram drones that does include built-in remote ID. That means it's legal for professional work, even without needing FAA registration. You're getting 4K video at 30 frames per second, optional 48 megapixel stills, and about 32 minutes of airtime. It's got a dedicated controller, solid GPS stability, and flies super smooth, even in wind. There's no obstacle avoidance, which is a bummer. But for under 350, it's hard to argue. If you're a certified pilot looking for a budget work drone, this one checks a lot of boxes. Number three is the DJI Air 3. And if you're serious about safety and camera versatility, this one's a beast. It rocks a dual camera setup with a wide angle lens and a 70 millimeter telephoto, both mounted on a super responsive gimbal. Obstacle avoidance is fully 360 degrees. It uses DJI's A-Pass system, so it'll fly around trees, fences, or whatever's in its way without your input. It's got great battery life, about 45 minutes in ideal conditions, and supports HDR, D-Log-M, and slow-mo features too. The downside? It's over the FAA's 250-gram limit, so registration is required. But if you're doing real estate, travel videos, or any serious gig work, this is a smart, future-ready drone. At number two, we've got the king of aerial cinema, the DJI Mavic 3 Pro. This isn't just a drone, it's a flying film rig. You get three cameras on board, including a four-thirds sensor tuned by Hasselblad, and it shoots up to 5.1K at 30 frames per second. There's a three times optical zoom lens, or more, and an ultra wide for big cinematic shots. With full surround obstacle detection, ProRes support on the Cine model, and up to one terabyte of SSD storage, this drone means business. Yeah, it's heavy. You'll need registration, a remote ID, and a pro license if you're working commercially. But for filmmakers and creators who want uncompromising quality, this is the top tier choice. And finally, at number one, we've got the drone I recommend to almost everyone, the DJI Mini 4 Pro. This is the most feature-packed ultralight drone on the market, period. It weighs just under 249 grams, so there's no registration needed for hobbyists. But don't let the size fool you. It's got full 360-degree obstacle avoidance, HDR and D-Log-M video, and a 48-megapixel camera that shoots 4K at 60 frames per second. It even supports vertical video for TikTok and Instagram. Battery life? Up to 34 minutes or more with the extended pack. Just note, that pushes it over the weight limit for registration. The Mini 4 Pro is smart, stable, and super easy to fly. Whether you're a weekend vlogger, a licensed drone pilot, or just want epic vacation vacation footage. This is the drone to beat in 2025. So there you have it, the five drones actually worth buying this year. Whether you're chasing cinematic shots, flying for fun, or working gigs as a licensed pilot, there's a pick here that'll match your needs and your budget. Did I miss your favorite model? Got questions about remote ID, batteries, or which drone works best for your content? Drop it in the comments. I read every one. If this helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Fly smart, stay legal, and keep that footage steady.